Now, local sports from KGBO. Hey there, everyone, and a happy Father's Day to the dads out there. Tomorrow, Truman State will hold its high school elite camp. The camp is for girls entering grades 9 through 12. It runs from 10.30 a.m. to 5 p.m. The cost is $60 and includes lunch in an elite camp t-shirt. Registration is at 10. To high school baseball, the Ottawa Bulldogs have hit the midpoint of the season at over 500. The Bulldogs had a successful tournament in Newton, winning two games. As all teams do, the Bulldogs went through some changes this season, but have still had success because of the younger, inexperienced players playing well. I mean, guys like uh, Parker Stout has come in huge, um, not only in the field, but on the mound for us. Austin Schatz has played well. Um, Jalen Jones is a freshman who stepped in at second base for us, has played well. Um, you know, just we, we got key contributors everywhere. It's not just one guy. Otomo is on the road all week and starts with a doubleheader against Des Moines North Monday. The Fairfield Trojans are trying to get back to the state tourney. The Trojans are ninth in 3A in the latest poll. Fairfield dropped two against Knoxville, but recovered with two wins against Albia before week's end. Coach Josh Al Allison is satisfied with where the team is at the mid stages of the season. We knew we had some work to do coming into the season. We really had, you know, we had some guys to replace from last year. And the guys have, have done a pretty nice job of getting, getting where we want them to go. We're going to keep working at it every day. Fairfield has some tough conference matchups with Washington at home tomorrow and traveling to Mount Pleasant on Thursday. Friday will be a big game with undefeated Van Buren. 